me caramel complexion. Oh, yeah. Girls swerving all the right directions. Oh, yeah. Love your attitude, mama taught that fly shit. Oh, yeah. Head to toe, killing them, no fly shit. Yeah. I'm doing a video today on my makeup routine, how I found my makeup to match my skin complexion, what I do to get to find that makeup, things that I must do, have to do, and I will do. So today I'm going to talk about our beautiful skin. As African American, we are some gorgeous people. Yes, we are. So my skin complexion is, my undertones for my skin complexion are is yellow undertones. I have a little red undertones also. So those are the two things you have to really find out. What are your undertones? So that when you pick up your makeup, you won't bring those out too much. You don't want a red face when you wear your makeup. You don't want a yellow face when you wear your makeup. You want a beautiful face when you put on your makeup. So the makeup, I've tried Clinique, Becca, um, Bobbi Brown. I've tried uh, Sephora makeup. I've tried, um, I've tried an array of makeups. I've tried them all. I've, I've went through all of them. I, I, MAC um, is the one that I've used before. I think that I found my favorite makeup. Um, I've tried them all. MAC makeup makes me look like I have been frying chicken and um, I'm getting ready to heat the grease up and like dump some chicken in and it's really bad. Um, MAC makeup NC45 is my color but um, it makes my face very, very oily. So I had to stop using it. I had to stop. I said, I can't do this anymore. So I went to try and find another makeup. I've tried them all. The Becca makeup was too thick for my skin complexion. Really, really thick. I was like, no, I don't want to go through that. I don't want no thick makeup on my face like that. Okay. Um, Clinique makeup, it's okay. Actually, I bought a new Clinique makeup and I can't even find it in my house. So I'm going to have to look for it. I was going to show you guys. I tried to look for it, but I couldn't find it. Oh. So my makeup of choice is um, that I'm using right now is I'm using Maybelline Fit. This is a drugstore makeup, CVS, Walmart, Walgreen, um, those kind of stores. Don't think that you have to go out and buy Chanel, uh, all the high-end makeups to get that great skin complexion or great coverage or a nice coverage. You don't have to do that. My whole makeup that I have on today is store, store, um, drugstore makeup. Even my, my, um, my shadow, my eyebrow, all that is drugstore. Because I can use the high end. Some things I do have high end and some things I don't. I mean, I don't really need the high end makeup to have a gorgeous face. I can beat my face with... Uh, regular CVS, Walgreens, and Walmart uh, makeup. So don't think that you have to go out and buy the expensive makeup to get that gorgeous face because you don't have to. You don't have to. So the next makeup that I am enjoying, okay, so I have the Maybelline that I love this Maybelline. Uh, Maybelline, they $5 at the store. Um, I bought two, two of them. Um, $10. This is like 30, 30 something. And it's gone up. As you guys know, on, on, July 1st, MAC makeup went up a dollar. All their makeup went up a dollar. I think it was a dollar or something like that, but I know their makeup went up a dollar. So that's like $38, $39, this makeup. $38, matter of fact, because I picked up some for my daughter. So $38. Um, and I purchased this for my skin. It's simple for me because I, I, I just know my skin. I know how it's going to work. So I picked up these two, Maybelline Fit. Maybelline Fit is great, great makeup. And what's so good about Maybelline is that they have added new colors to their Rasta of colors. They have went to the darker, darker skin. I think dark skin women are so gorgeous. I think their skin is like chocolate butter where you just want to just it is just gorgeous and i love a dark skin chick so um i love their skin complexion so this makeup is very good they have moved up to more colors so if you go to um walgreen walmart all those colors check out the new colors that they have added i'm not a dark skin girl i do have a almost dark skin chow she's like a 
she's not dark but she has it's hard for her to find that color she's like in between like at the end of the dark and then going to the darker and then what the but the end of the dark is not too not right so it's like hard to find her color for her but for me um, I've done this for so long and I know my skin so I picked up these two I picked up uh, number 335 and I picked up number 330 so these two work very good on my face so and then I said okay let me try the L'Oreal fit me which I've been wearing L'Oreal fit me uh, the pearl matte because I love a matte face I love a matte face but during the summertime it is just too hot to have a matte face because your face dry us as african-american women women our face change colors in the seasons summertime our skin get really dark because we're in the sun we're swimming we playing sports we out with the sunroof down with the convertible down it's like our skin changes colors in the summer we get really really dark my skin i get really dark so that means i have to do a lot of highlighting when my skin is dark and it's winter time oh i'm back to normal my skin is at a right is that a great color then it's like it's winter time it's like oh yeah this is this is it so um i was wearing in the winter time i was wearing the um pro matte but i had to stop wearing the pro matte because um my skin was way too dry it was just extra extra dry and then going out in the summertime it was just too much so i had to go and find another um l'oreal foundation so i picked up the uh, pro glow um l'oreal they have the luminous they have another one out i mean they have l'oreal is doing really good l'oreal has better colors also they have moved down the spectrum of colors for dark skinned women which is really good i think if you're going to make makeup for the whites the in-betweens you need to go further in with making makeups for african-american skin we want our skin to be just as gorgeous as the people with the light skin we want that so i picked up the pro glow and it's not like glowing like oh glow it's not like that and it's not but it's really really watery it's like really smooth like it's it comes out very easy than the matte the matte you have to shake it out the pro glow is really really like really soupy soupy so i picked up that those are the makeups that i am wearing on my skin complexion now i am wearing um l'oreal and maybelline uh for l'oreal um also when you wanting to do a highlight for me i've seen um where you can go out and buy the highlight you can go out and purchase a different little makeup and do your little triangle and then your little tree and then your little um roots and all that with the highlight but if you are wanting to save money also you can pick up a very lighter lighter color makeup and you can highlight with your makeup also you don't have to go out and buy um highlight you can buy you can pick up a lighter makeup i'm going to show you this one you can pick up a really light foundation and then that's great you can use that as a highlighter so you don't always have to go out and buy highlights you can also use your makeup as a highlighter and then um, you can always set it with your setting powder of course the setting powder powder is always light also so those are the things I do I'm not running out to the store when I see um, videos or stuff like that with people showing uh, you need this to get this do this do that I'm not that girl I'm not that girl that's running out to the store saying oh let me go get it I'm gonna get what I think that's gonna work for me where I can make it work and I do make it work I think there's three things women need to pay attention to and it's their face their body and their cooch those three things are very important <laughs> important so ladies i'm just stopping by just giving you what i know and how i feel today um you can take it if, if how you feel if you want it you don't have to take it but i'm giving it to you anyway yes so that is what i use on my skin it works for me i have used the high-end makeup i spent all the money and i didn't like it i'm seem to always taking it back so good way to do that if you want the high-end makeup try and get a sample go to the the drugstore, CVS, all those places, and try to find that dupe to that makeup. And I'm most definitely sure you will find the dupe for that makeup because 
they are coming out and Maybelline and and L'Oreal they are coming out with better colors to fit your skin and I think it's wonderful so I just want to stop by guys and show you and tell you about my skin complexion and let you know that I love makeup have a good day guys bye